Pat Esposito started Environmental Technologies and Communications, or ETC, in 1994 to help business and industry do a better job of telling their environmental stories to the public. She'll be the first to tell you her idea of running a business that sets the record straight on highly charged environmental issues was a long shot, even though it was clearly needed. Uh, it was an uphill sell. Um... To, to try to get business to tell stories where they were re reluctant to tell their stories, to do more outreach and communication when they didn't want to do any at all. Pat could see that the media was frequently reporting environmental news that was strongly biased against business and often incomplete or technically incorrect. So she assembled a team of seasoned experts who understand public relations and complicated environmental issues. It's that special and unique blend of technical and communication expertise that helps ETC tell the environmental stories of businesses and industry truthfully, accurately, fair and balanced. In many ways, this bridge symbolizes what ETC is all about. Their goal is to build bridges of understanding on environmental health and safety issues between their clients and their audiences. We bring so much more than any standard or traditional public relations firm can bring and, and what that does for the client is it saves the client a lot of time and trouble in teaching um, those fundamentals and those nuances so you don't say it wrong, you don't make a claim that actually the scientists won't support. It allows the clients to, to spend more time dealing with their own business and their own problems while we handle the information. ETC works on just about every kind of environmental subject there is, whether it's air pollution, drinking water, sewers and wastewater, groundwater contamination, solid and hazardous waste management, or asbestos. The company has a long list of clients it represents not only in Cincinnati, but in neighboring states like Kentucky, Indiana, and Michigan, and from as far away as France. Locally, ETC helped the Metropolitan Sewer District launch its Water in Basement Customer Assistance Program in January of 2004 to help people recover and clean up sewage-flooded basements. It's a totally unique program. I don't know of any other wastewater utility in the country that provides direct assistance uh, to their customers in this way. Uh, we don't just tell them to, well, you figure it out, you hire someone, you clean it up and send us the bill. We actually bring out the customer service uh, to them, to their home. We clean up the mess at no charge to them. We document, with their help, um, any property that they have that's been damaged and lost. We help them sort it out. More recently, ETC has helped MSD set up a new program to provide information and assistance to customers who live and work in neighborhoods where major sewer construction projects are happening. Hundreds of customers have benefited from that service, as you can see from their positive comments. Customers have told us repeatedly in surveys uh, how highly satisfied they are with that service. Kim Lehman is a senior environmental communication specialist who enjoys going door to door, listening to the concerns of the community, creating letters, brochures, meeting with citizen advisory groups, anything to give everyone involved a solid understanding of the topic. She says the company has won many awards for its environmental communications in national and international competitions for many reasons. But she says the company has seen steady growth because it fills a real and growing need for better business communications about their impact on the environment. Another reason ETC has had such a successful track record is its philosophy on environmental integrity and ethics. I think trust and integrity are the pillars of ETC. Well, ethics um, has been number one house rule from the get-go, from day one. We must have the highest standards of truthfulness and integrity in the work we do. Smoke and mirrors is not part of our operation.